Hey everyone, how you doing? It's day 31. Wait, it is not day 31. Who knows what day it is? It's Mr. Arul coming at you from his couch somewhere in New York City. If you haven't guessed what we're doing today or don't know what's going on, today we'll be learning how to use chopstick with Mr. Arul. So chopsticks come in all sizes and made from different materials for example we have our wooden ones right here we have our plastic ones and unfortunately i don't have the metal chopsticks uh, but for today's episode we're going to be using our number two pencils as chopsticks if you don't have a pair of chopsticks like i do now that you have your pencils in front of you you want to grab one of them and you want to make sure that uh, the eraser is pointing downward, not upward. And the very first step is you want to make sure that the pencil is placed between your thumb and your pointer finger. And it should look something like this. And the very last, the other step is you want to also place the pencil on top of your ring finger. And it should look something like this. Now that you've learned step one, you move on to step two. And you want to grab your pencil and you want to place it in between your pointer and middle finger. And it should look something like this. And your thumb should be coming down and clamping down like so. And it should look something like this. It sort of looks like you're grabbing a pencil. Now that you've learned the figure placement, Let's learn the motion. And the motion looks something like this. It sort of looks like I'm writing or painting in the air. And you can even also pretend like you're squiggling the lines like this. And that's all that's all the motion. That's all you're doing basically. And you should practice this for maybe um, a couple of minutes. Um, and eventually you'll get it. Now that we've learned step one, step two, and the motion, it's time to bring it all together and practice. So it should look something like this. So if you keep on doing this for, you know, practice for about a week or so, you should get the hang of it. But I just recommend that you practice for a while. 